what is up guys and welcome to another python 3 video in this video we'll be seeing about tick enter with gui in the previous video we learned something on how to get into a geometry and how to create a window and basics of it in this video we'll be seeing about how to create a label label something create a text field output text and how to represent a frame in a window so let's begin with an example and new so first of all we'll be importing tick enter from winter import star and then we'll be providing a object for tick enter window that's that's basic and We'll be providing a title to it. Sorry. Welcome. Then we'll go on to labeling something. So, oh no, we'll be um, beginning with a frame. How to create a frame? So for for that we have to create a frame object frame 1 is equal to the actual frame method root comma first of all let's provide dimensions to it so it will be easy to create a frame geometry 500 into 500 and close so what we provide here is that width of it is equal to 500 and height is equal to 500 it will be easy so yep and we will be providing a background color background or foreground it will be shown later background will be like powder blue blue close and frame one dot back side is equal to left and we'll just run the program so let's see whether it runs or not random name so this is the frame which we have created that is 500 and this will do entire thing it's like a portion where you can keep all your uh, widgets of tick enter the actual method so also like a basic color background background color but it's more like a frame so this is how you can create a frame and you can also customize it you can go and look in like here help tick enter so you get all the documentation or some kind of syntax that python tick enter provides so you can search and write in frame So these are frames and you can label it and do various things with it too. So let's go on further and create a label. So for that we will create an object label 1 and the actual method label root comma obviously the width I guess is 4 and we will not provide height to it. So lab 1 dot place okay and here we provide a text too so what should we'll say it as 
name comma and place this type word x is equal to 0 comma y is equal to mm, 3 say and run so this is how you can label any entry field or text box in Kinter. so this is it and you can also provide font to it like example font is equal to bracket times there are various fonts in it you should know the font name and you can just provide like this times the size of it like 20 and bold so as you can see name uh, in the font times new roman and the size of it is 20 and this is how you label things while creating a GUI and next thing we'll see is that a text field for that we'll uh, give an object name text is equal to the actual text root comma width of it will provide like a hundred and the height of it will be is equal to hundred sorry for the disturbance over there it's like annoying but so I have to carry out one text one and you can place where you want is x is equal to five let us say it is five and y is equal to six I'm just guessing out these numbers I'm actually really bad at this so oh that's pretty big one so I just have to reduce it mm, we'll go with like 10 and 20 maybe so oh, uh, the position is like oh uh, you have to calibrate it it's too difficult so I'll just do it like back that's easiest one okay so where is a text box uh, it's here select too far we'll look in C uh, back side is equal to Mm, left it's not yet there but let's do the place itself place is equal to x is equal to like 8 or 10 maybe and y is equal to 0 so we have a text field over here but it's like overlapping the labels so you just need to do is that you need to just change the position of it like go a bit like 100 let's try it out yep and this is how like a text field you can create text box you just need to calibrate the x and y axis so you can place it exactly where you want and yep that's it and the next thing we'll see is an entry thing entry uh, entry widget and for that we'll create an object entry1 is equal to the actual method entry root comma it's width width is equal to 4 and don't need height for it and we'll give some font to it font is equal to just copy and copy this one and just paste one here and then and then we'll close it packing it d1 dot pack 
pack will be not appropriate i guess let's see what ENT1 what's the problem yes i just forgot to give one window over there there's the hmm it's too far it's over here like uh, but we need to change that it's not appropriate and we'll go with something like again the classic way x and y x is equal to let's give it as 200 and y is equal to 10 maybe so this is how you can provide a text wheel which is in a precise manner and it's not like a text box these two are different things this is only for uh, text field is something like you can get any output you can show results in it and text field is something entry field is something like you can type in a name and go and search in the database or something like that as per i know and yes frame text label and yep that's that's it that's pretty much and see you in the next one